And that is how you pull a secret rare. You have to believe in yourself because if you don't, who will believe in you? What's up, Joe Crew? It is me, Joku DMD, and today I'm gonna show you how to pull a secret rare out of a booster box of Supreme Rivalry, set 13 of the Dragon Ball Super Card Game, set four of the Unison Warrior block. These boxes could have secret rares, but I'm gonna show you how you guarantee to pull yourself a secret rare out of one of these boxes. Anyway, guys, if this is your first time here and you wanna see Shrippums every single week, make sure to smush that subscription button if you're a returning member of the Joe Crew. Thank you for your continued support. And I hope this video helps in learning how to always pull a secret rare from a set. Let's get into this. Sh 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 rip them. The first thing you're gonna need if you wanna pull a secret rare is a dragon's knife. No, just kidding. You can use any knife, but cut it here, it's nice. And make sure to pre-order your booster boxes of Dragon Ball Super Card Game. You always wanna pre-order cards. Never wait till release, because they're gonna be sold out and they're gonna be overpriced. So pre-order your cards. And a great place to pre-order your cards is we got the SR Mechacabra. A great place to pre-order your cards is Gamers RS. Check them out. They are down in Cocoa, Florida. The boys always get me my cards. Oh, here is the Bless em. You gotta bless them a pack if you wanna pull a secret rare. Oh, Gohan be blessed. Androids be blessed. Give us our secret rare for the rest of recipe but yeah pre-order your cards guys down you know hit up gamers are also be a just there'll be a link in the description below drop them a line and make sure that you just you gotta shrip them and you gotta believe in yourself that you're gonna pull a secret rare and go on yo yo and that is how you pull a secret rare you have to believe in yourself because if you don't who will believe in you and you have to know that the secret rare is in this box and believe what you will pull it the secret rare Wow, oh my god, yo, this is an insane looking card, what? We are gonna have to take a closer look at this. Wow, whoa, Yosha, whoa, Sha, Yosha. I have to put on my 3.5 magnification loops here. Wow, oh, oh, whoa, Yosha, yo, Gohan's SS3, what the heck? What a, what a beautiful piece of cardboard. Oh my god, whoa, yo, how, wow. Are you kidding me? This is just too gorgeous. Oh my god. Yo, oh, ow, whoa, yo, wow, oh, whoa, yo, yo, this card looks so, they put reverse foiling into his hair, absolute champions, look at the gradation of the way that it's foiled and the holographic in the background, the gold stamp, this is one of the best looking secret rares I've ever seen, this is one of the best looking secret rares ever produced in the Dragon Ball Super card game, this is gonna need to get sent in for a grade, I do not have a choice about that, wow, the surface looks amazing, the corners look perfect. Centering looks really good. Really fantastic centering. Wow. Oh my god. Oh my god. Okay, so you guys, if you want to send these cards in to get graded, I recommend getting a soft cloth. I use my t-shirts because my t-shirts are very soft. And just dust off the card. And the way you want to dust it is outward towards the edges. So like this, you take your shirt and you just wipe it towards the edge. Make sure you get any fingerprints off of there, get any dust, pull the edges together. If the edge ever separated at all, you're just pulling it all together, make it nice and crisp. And yeah, that is an absolutely gorgeous card. If the Dragon Ball Super Card Game design team keeps this up, the prices on these cards are just gonna skyrocket because these are just absolutely gorgeous. I don't know any collector that wouldn't wanna have this card in their collection. This is so good looking. The composition, just the balance of shapes within the card, the way they layered the text, the full art, it's a, it's a good card too. This four drop unison is good. Just an absolutely gorgeous, gorgeous card. If you have an inner sleeve and put an outer sleeve, and they're nice and protected, and these are custom Joku DMD sleeves, which you can get from your playmat. If you haven't checked them out, I got a link in the description below with a unique link where you can get 10% off by using my link, or you can make yourself some sleeves. I'm also gonna be doing a giveaway, so check out my Instagram for that giveaway, but oh my God, though, such a gorgeous, gorgeous card. And of course, after you put it in your sleeves, you gotta put it in a semi-rigid sleeve here. So there we go, SCR tucked away. What a pull. And guys, that is how you pull a secret rare. That's how you do it. I hope that helped on learning the technique of how to do that. Now, of course, I'm gonna be real with you guys. You can't just buy a box and guarantee that there'll be a secret rare in it. The only way that you can guarantee that you're gonna get a secret rare is by getting a case. And depending on the set, 
and how many secret rares there are that will determine how many secret rares are in the case so for example this set had three secret rares in the set which means there were two secret rares in the case so if you got a case you were guaranteed to get two secret rares now i basically just opened up boxes and kept doing the same thing over and over and over until i got secret rares yo frieza invader from another dimension not a bad spr of course in the custom joku dmd sleeve from your playmat guys check them out use my link in the description but yeah if you want to guarantee if you want to guarantee that you're going to pull a secret rare really the only way to do it is by buying a case and i learned that a long time ago and i've been buying cases ever since really and in your case you will get two secret rares and you will get one god pack and you have to strip them until you pull them so i know it was a little tricky i told you you're gonna know how to do it but i do it every every set every set i pull secret rares and the reason why i pull secret rares every set is because i get cases and a great place to get your cases is at gamers are us so check them out there'll be a link in the description below drop them a line tell them joking dmd sent you and say boys i want to get a case and you gotta pre-order make sure you pre this is a gorgeous parallel foil you have to pre-order if you don't pre-order you're not going to guarantee that you're going to get your cards and if you don't pre-order you're also going to pay a lot more for your cards cards cost a lot more on release they're overpriced there's never enough over here everybody wants them the pre-release cards are all in the same prices so just pre-order your boxes hit up gamers r us tell them joku sent you over there and oh another galactic buster that's a great sr tell them joku sent you and say hey guys joku sent me over here he said you got some great pirate guys over here and you can help me out get a booster box some booster boxes but if you want to if you want to guarantee that you're going to get a secret rare you've got to get a case there's no if ands or buts about it and if you get a case you will get secret rares it is a guarantee with the dragon ball super card game uh, as you saw i just pulled a secret rare, and that's because i pulled it from a case that i just opened because i pulled it from a case that i opened and i know that it wasn't tampered with i know that there were two secret rares in there and i got the secret rare out of there and i shrip them you just gotta shrip them until you do it and you know the believing yourself thing is fun it's an enjoyable thing to do it's fun to believe in yourself because it can motivate you about you and then you get to strip them and say hey look i believed in myself the whole time and i knew that i was going to strip them these cards and strip them these gorgeous pieces of cardboard yosha king vegeta's imposing presence and a parallel foil kai leader very rad gotta put that in the joku dmd custom sleeve from your playmat make sure to go check out my instagram and follow me for there'll be a giveaway soon and you can use my unique code in the description below to get yourself uh some custom sleeves of your own and save 10 percent but yeah this is the bless them the pack that's it we know it's not going to be a secret rare and it's not going to be sprs because we already pulled them we know the ratios and it is a parallel foil unison Anyway, guys, I am Joku DMD. This has been how to pull a secret rare strip them. I know it's a little not straightforward and you may have known that you need a case, but if you want to split a case with a friend, that's a great way to get a case and you'll each get a secret rare. You can trade stuff that you pull. Um, make sure to hit up Gamers R Us. They are fantastic about getting you your cards. Great group of guys over there. I am a dentist. I can't end the episode without doing a dental tooth tip. So guys, make sure to be brushing your teeth twice a day for two minutes in the morning and at night. Get yourself a Sonicare and run that thing for the whole two minutes. It'll tell you every 30 seconds when to switch quadrants. Make sure to be using your Listerine Ultra Clean Flosser at night before you brush and floss as long as you can. Pop a new head in there, go hang out and build some decks. Chill on the couch, check out the new cards, learn about the game and floss at the same time. I hope this was helpful. If you are new to the channel and you love seeing shrippums and you wanna see more shrippums and more secret rares get open inevitably, make sure to smush that subscription button if you're a returning member of the Joe Crew. Thank you for coming by and I'll see you guys next time.